Hey everybody, how's it going? I'm camping today, and here's my campsite. Got my kayak, and there the water's back there. And I just wanted to share breakfast with you because I haven't seen you in a while. And, and share some family drama that I've been going through. So, this is my breakfast. It's oatmeal, uh, cranberry almond instant oatmeal. And what you can do is just open up the bag, pour some water in there, and voila, your breakfast is ready. So that's what I've been eating for breakfast these few days. So anyway, um, my cousin Sally called me yesterday and she said, she said, Brody, I need your help. I'm being held ransom. And I said, what the hell? What's going on here? I gotta call the police. And she said, no, don't call the police because they won't help. And I was like, what? What are you talking about? And she said, she said, I'm being held ransom. I need you to uh, wire me $500. And I was like, well, damn, Sally, didn't you just ask for $1,000 last month? You know what I'm saying? Family, they just keep asking for money all the time. They think I'm rich because I have a YouTube channel, but it ain't that, it ain't that glitzy, you know? Anyway, so, I just want to give you a little backstory. This is, uh, Sally is an interesting woman. She is my cousin, and she was the inventor of the zipper pillowcase. And uh, she has millions of dollars. So I don't know why she's asking me for money. Because she is she's rich. And she don't share with anybody else. Maybe she went bankrupt or something. But I don't know who these people are kidnapping her either. Because uh, $500 ain't that much money, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, I think I'm going to have to Zoom call her up and see. She said her GPS tracker isn't working on her phone. She said her last known location was, um, she was working a, a booth at the mall trying to sell her pillowcases. And then somebody snatched her up, I guess. Somebody put the pillowcase over her head and, and they ran out. And so I, I really don't know what to do. Because she said not to call the police, just to send $500. I mean, I don't know, what do y'all think? Should I just send the money? Because something seems a little fishy to me, if you know what I mean. But I would feel bad if she, like, you know... got killed or something for me not sending my whole paycheck she told me they were trying to steal her prototype for the next uh, zipper pillowcase invention she thought up I said look Sally I don't know if I believe you or not. Because you've cried wolf a few times before. And she said, no, 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 this is real, you know. She said, I called you on this phone that I found in the, in the room they're holding me captive in. And uh, they don't have no GPS or anything, so you can't find me. So, that sounds strange to me. Why would they leave a phone in there? I think I might just call the cops on her. And, and if she's lying, then, you know, I'm going to cut her off. 
she's not in the family no more. You know what I'm saying? So, if you ever see a zipper, a zipper pillowcase, you know, that's Sally's invention. I'm out here camping. It's the best kind of social distancing you can do. Because there's nobody here at the campground. I guess nobody camps during the week. But I don't really have a job. So I said might as well just go camping because um, I'm tired of applying for jobs. So uh, yeah, I'm banking on my music career to launch me into success. So I hope when I share you my songs with you, you'll enjoy them. Because, uh, that's my only shot. That's my only shot right now is my music career. And my YouTube career, of course. But, you know. Who knows. I might be able to get a job with the city cleaning toilets or something. But, haven't got any callbacks yet. Alright, well that's my story with Sally, and thanks for enjoying breakfast with me, and I'll keep you updated. Um, I might call her and record it and see what y'all think. I might FaceTime her or something if that phone she has has it. So, we'll, we'll try to figure this out together, and uh, see you next time. I'll keep you uh, posted. I might film some more video of me camp and show you what I have for dinner and such. Um, I've been trying to fish around here, but can't get anything to bite yet. So we'll see what's going on. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.